today I am going to teach you how to play Keyboard Kittens. Now first I will show you everything that you will get when you get the Keyboard Kittens download. You will get the instruction sheet, you will get the I Did Possum success poster. There are two activity sheets. There's the beginner one for piano keys and the advanced one where they name the notes to decode the missing words in the story. You have eight adorable kitten game pieces that your students can choose from. And as you see here, there is the game board, level one cards, and level two cards. Let me show you what's inside the different levels of cards. So both levels of cards have these specialty cards. And these are, if you look on the board, there's A, B, C, D, and then they have like the fish bone right there. There's the two piano keys right there the bowl right there. So if a student ever gets these specialty cards, notice this is the two black notes, this is the three black notes, they will jump to that section on the board. So if they happen to be up here and they get a fish bone, they have to move back to right there. So these specialty cards are in both levels one and levels two. Level one cards are on the keyboard. And so what the student will do is name the note. So that is a B and then they would travel up to the B. And there are also these two octave cards. If a student gets this, there are two C's. That means they move forward two C's. So they'd move forward one C, two C's. Level two cards are very similar, but they're notes on the staff. So the level two cards cover up to two ledger lines below and above the staff. There are notes in the treble clef staff and in the bass clef staff. What the student will do is name the note, so that is an A, and then they would move to the place, next place on the board. This one is a C, they would move to the next place on the board. And if they get an octave, this is octave Fs, they would move two Fs. So they would move this F and this F. Okay, let's play some keyboard kittens. I will show you how to play keyboard kittens with both levels at the same time. So let's say you had two siblings who were coming to lessons together and they wanted to play the game. So you can have the younger student play with level one while the older student plays with level two. And it will be a fairly even gameplay. Or you can obviously play with just level one cards or just level two cards. But I'm gonna show you how to do with both of them. To start the game, each student will choose a kitten. So we're going to say the black cat is level one, and let's do the orange cat for level two. The youngest player goes first. Flip up a card, identify it, this is an A, and then move to that place on the board. So they will move to the A. Player two, that is a D, they will move to the D. This is the two black notes, so that's a specialty card. So the student gets to go up to the two black notes. And they also get the two black notes, so they also move up here and just kind of put them side by side. This is an A. Black cat finds the next A. Now, they landed on the tracks, so they will get to walk up bonus. This is an octave A. This means that the student moves up two A's. So they will go to this A and then to this A, which this one has the feet going up, so they will walk up. Two E's, so they move up two E's. So here's one. And then the next one is right there, so they're sharing that spot again. C. G, G, B, D. Ooh, they get the fishbone. That means they have to go all the way back to the fishbone. And they get the bowl, so they have to go all the way back to the bowl. A, F, C, A, 
They landed on the paw prints again, so they get to travel up. The mouse, they get to travel all the way up to the mouse. F. D. Three black notes, they get to go up to the specialty three black notes. G. Two Fs, so that means they get to move up two Fs. Well, there are no Fs left, so that means that they have just one. And if you want to finish the gameplay out, they get the three black notes, and that student can continue. F, and they win. That is how the game is played. Once you are finished playing the game, Take a picture with your students who won and share it on social media. Feel free to tag us at Music Game Club on YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, and Facebook. For even more review, don't forget to send your students home with the worksheets. The beginning students get to color theirs, and then the more advanced students get to write a story by naming the notes. We hope that you have fun with Keyboard Kittens. We can't wait to see what you and your students do with it.